all right so we just got here to this target in dallas and they actually have stuff on the shelf which i'm very surprised to see they have a pretty good amount of retail packs in the rookies and stars retail box and they also have close to eight or nine or ten blasters of the rookies and stars i'll definitely be grabbing some of those just to rip down here and overall here's a pretty good look at everything else they got some top series one a lot of baseball overall pretty surprisingly good variety considering there's a big show tomorrow and overall pretty solid restock <laughs> all right so we just got here to the dallas walmart and as you guys can see it is looking pretty bare well they got some Yu-Gi-Oh. this is the sports over here looks like they have some return labels um see if we can find anything good in here it's not looking too good they do have some hanger boxes but overall it's pretty underwhelming stock here at dallas texas walmart so we're definitely not going to hang out here much or too long all right so we just got here to meyer and it looks like they have a pretty good variety to choose from Looks like I have the brand new 2022 Draft Picks Basketball, some Don Russ and Mosaic Football. It's the first time I think I've seen the Holiday Football Don Russ Blasters. So you get one um, Holiday Sweater Memorabilia card. You got some Prism and Optic Older Basketball. We got All Reliable right here, Zenith Football. This is a pretty great restock, a ton of variety. Not sure if I'm gonna get anything. Might scoop up some of these. I'm not sure with the Meyer markup. But overall, definitely a very solid restock. All right. And we're also gonna get into opening a 2022 Donruss and Zenith football blaster boxes. These products both offer a pretty high ceiling with Zenith offering one auto or memorabilia and obviously being able to pull the downtowns and crunch times from Donruss. So we'll just nose dive right into the rip. Hopefully we can pull some bangers. We'll start We'll uh, start with Donruss. You guys can see the crunch time, the production line, the uh, downtowns. It'd be cool to obviously pull one of those. I haven't had much luck from the blasters this year or hobby. <clears throat> You guys want to take a second to look those are all the odds and parallels you can pull got six total packs you guys already know what's up everyone say a prayer to the card gods and let's get active all right as always you're going to start with a ton of base with donruss a lot of base vets we have tyler boyd and then usually the last three cards you'll get some rookies in it some inserts as well we have andrew booth jr for our first rookie chinny tindall and that's gonna do it for pack one moving along here all right and if anyone has pulled any autographs from this product comment below because I don't know if I've seen anyone pull one. I've seen a, a couple people get lucky with downtowns. We have Sky Moore, rookie for the Chiefs. Then we have Martin E. Merson. And we have a backwards card. It's going to be Ray Lewis. Not sure. That's one problem I really don't like about the blasters is that sometimes the inserts are backwards as the last card in the pack, which obviously if it's like this, you're touching it the whole time. Fingerprints are getting everywhere. I wish that the uh, inserts were like more towards the middle. All right, moving along. Skipping through the vets. Unless any pop out, obviously. We have Clinton Portis. Gary. Got another backwards card back there. Um, Bo Melton rookie. Jamison Williams. Nice. And a Dominators Devontae Adams. 
solid rookie pull. Seem like they're uh, pretty stingy with the rookies in these blasters. We got another backwards card back there. Hope there's not any ink back there and I'm just smearing it all in. We do got a Brady there. You also have to look for the full name parallels. It'll have their full name, middle name included. And those actually are selling pretty well, so they must be pretty rare. Something to keep an eye out for. We have Kyle Hamilton, rookie. Brandon Smith. And a David Bell. I swear I pulled this card like 16 times. It's like I must have the worst luck, or that dude hopefully can turn out to be the next GOAT. <laughs> Moving along. base Chris Carson this card has like smear now smear all over the card Michael Pittman a lot of these cards do look like they have thumbprints on them looks like there's a clean streak right across the cards Tua Jamar and then for rookies we have Jordan Davis Carson Strong and a portrait canvas of Matt Corral. Sick card. I also have not pulled or seen anyone pull any of the optic rated rookie parallels that you can pull from these blasters. So you, there's a lot that these blasters offer. They're just tough to, tough to pull. Nice card though. And our last pack of Donner. We're moving on to <clears throat> Before moving on to Zenith. All right, we have Antoine Winfield, Cooper Cup. Look at this. Why does every card have that like streak through it? Super random, and it feels feels weird too. Every card has it. It's crazy. All right, we have Devonte Smith, Chase Young, Elijah Moore. We have Arnold. We got a red rookie of Sauce Gardner. Take that. And a Trey McBride on the back. So, yikes. That's what's tough about Donruss is when you don't have a blaster with one of the nice inserts, it's just tough. And we still got some nice pulls, though. Cool sauce gardener. We got the nice Matt Corral. Let's move on to Almighty... All trustworthy Zenith football. You get one auto or memorabilia card. It should say on the box or points. Because Panini loves to throw in points with all of their uh, auto boxes. At least for me. Hopefully we can pull a nice numbered card. Or any of the awesome inserts that Zenith has to offer. If you guys have pulled any bangers from either of these products, definitely comment below, share. Curious to hear who's pulling bangers out there. And let's get active. First pack of Zenith. Starting it off with Daniel Jones. Got a red Saquon Barkley. We have a rookie, Christian Watson. And... Nice. Love these no huddle pink slash purple foils. Clean card. They're not numbered, but they do look nice. Pulled a Justin Tucker auto parallel. All right. So this pack is short a card. We only have three cards in this pack. It's a bummer. We got Mike Williams. Deshaun Watson and a Josh Allen on the 92 Pacific. Gorgeous card. I pulled pretty much every player you could ask for in this. From this uh, set, subset. Got the Patty Mahomes, pulled Burrow, pulled Brady. 
definitely a fan of this insert for sure. All right, four packs to go. This pack feels like there's like two cards in there. There is two cards in there. What the heck? All right, we have Aaron Rodgers in a red of Leonard Fournette. What in the heck? All right, so we're halfway through this box. It's looking random. So we got a jersey card here, probably. We got Tom Brady up front. DeAndre Swift, color guard, patch. As the, the patch is all damaged right there. Mm, this is a tough box. Bo Mel and Haskins. We do got a Z Stars Burrow on the back, at least. Oh. So we definitely don't have any autos. We're getting shorted cards. Our memorabilia card is damaged. This is probably the, this is without a doubt the worst box I've had of Xena. This pack is shorted card as well. Three cards in here. What the heck? We got Von Miller, Marquise Brown, and a Ed Reed class president. So, so far, I think we're short like five cards. This pack is short too. How many cards is in here? One. Three cards in here. Jamar, Godwin, and Turpin on the red zone. Wow. So that was, that was rough. That was rough. You guys will have to comment below your thoughts on that Zenith Blaster. So I'm sure you know what my thoughts are. Let's go over all of the pulls from the two Blasters, though. I mean, we got some nice stuff. Pretty cool, bro. Got the Color Guard Swift. Pits. And our best pulls were the Sauce Gardener Red. Matt Corral Canvas. And the Josh Allen 92 Pacific. Pretty nice cards right there, but overall, pretty frustrating rip, I'll say. <laughs> and uh, that's going to do it for this video. So comment below what your guys' thoughts are. If you enjoyed, you know what to do. Show some love as always. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace out.